was to perform a person who lived in the early 60s. So you weren't born at that time. How was it? Did you do some research? Yeah, I mean, it's the most uh, fantastic thing that can happen to an actress to uh, play in another time period. Everybody wishes to, to play uh, a movie in an, in an hysteric, historical uh, um, place. So yeah, we did a lot of researches, we, uh, uh, we checked a lot uh, with the rhythm of that time, uh, the music, the, the feeling that that's the most fascinating thing to me. To be someone completely different than you are, that's fantastic. It's like dreaming something and wake up and then you're suddenly back in your original uh, reality. Yeah, escaping from reality, that fascinates me the most. Okay, how, what's spoilers, happening? Just little spoilers. Yeah. Gisela is a, a very simple factory girl, working um, day and night, uh, stop dreaming, um, stop uh, dreaming of a life girls in that age dreamt of and suddenly there appears love in her life and uh, suddenly everything changes like it is. She tries to, uh, she starts to become hungry, yeah, hungry for herself, hungry for a future and she starts to develop in a completely new uh, human being. She, she starts to feel being a woman again, yeah, she probably never felt in her life. That's what love does to, to women. I'm searching for stories, I'm interested in documentaries, and one day I uh, found an old documentary about uh, Gisela Bella, who was the first bank robber um, in Germany. Thankfully, I found uh, a very famous uh, German TV channel, the first uh, TV channel in Germany, and I tried to find the director. And Christian Albert and me, we are friends since uh, 20 years. <laughs> Which are the best things and the worst things for an actress? Um, oh no, I don't know the word in English. Um, Zweifel. I don't know what Zweifel is. Um, you don't know either, no? Um, it's a bit of an insecurity. Insecurity is something horrible that you have. Directors, producers have this impression of new films and being very connected to reality, to actuality, or to historical things. Mm -hmm. Do you have the same impression? Oh, I have no idea. Uh, um, of course, I love projects that are close to reality. Nothing touches you that much than the truth. Yeah, of course, maybe that's the reason why more and more filmmakers search for truthful stories. I love to see everything that is touching me. It's just that simple. I mean, I have no uh, favorite genre. I don't have uh, favorite filmmakers. Uh, everything that touches my heart, I'm interested in.